This is Bumper to Bumper TV. This is a demonstration of betting the farm, so to speak, for the Ford light truck lineup. The F-150, arguably one of the most recognized and revered nameplates in the company's portfolio, got a major makeover with the latest edition. The most dramatic change was, of course, an aluminum body to replace the traditional steel composite panels. When it was rolled out for the automotive press, there were skeptics about the durability of the new sheet metal and concern about the cost of repair, and the jury's still out on that. Ford has moved ahead, and the result is a truck that is lighter, easier to handle, and more fuel efficient. The reduced weight is obvious on the doors. Unlike the steel model, this lighter aluminum requires a little more effort to close it tight. Electric power steering also took some pounds off and is surprisingly efficient in something this big. Under the hood, Ford is continuing its EcoBoost agenda with two turbo-assisted V6 blocks. Our test vehicle came with a new 2.7 liter version, cranking out 325 horsepower and 375 foot-pounds of torque. A 3.5 liter V6, also EcoBoost equipped, is rated at 365 horsepower and 420 foot-pounds of torque. And the 2.7 liter V6 also comes with auto stop, thus saving fuel when stopped at a traffic light. But this is a truck which is meant to do the hard work, and the small block EcoBoost platform can do that. It has a 6-speed automatic transmission that is tow rated. The big item Ford wants to sell is that the new F-150 is lighter than its predecessor by 700 pounds and it is still capable of doing what drivers buy trucks for. The company is hoping that, along with better fuel economy, will keep the nameplate successful in light of strong competitors from all sides. This is Greg Morrison. We want to know what you think, so email us. The address is bumper to bumper tv at cs.com.